Hello everybody and welcome to my next video. I'm going to show you how to make another paper flower. So this is a different type. Fairly easy to make, nice one to do with the children. Help, nice to get them involved while everybody's off school and off work. Um, very simple to make, you just need very few things to do with it. So what we're going to need is we're going to need some paper. And I've already pre-cut mine just to save a little bit of time. This is 11 centimetres in width. OK, so cut that out um, and I've got some circles here for the middle of the flower. And this is about five centimetres in diameter. OK, so you need two of those. They can either be contrasting colours or the same colours. It's entirely up to you how you want to do it. So the first thing we're going to do is turn our paper over. Then we're going to use double sided tape. Now, today I'm using double sided tape and glue dots. You can use a glue stick, a print stick if you want to. I'm just using these for speed. OK, so we are going to put our double sided tape across the bottom. And trim that off. Right. Take the backing tape off of the double sided tape and fold this over and stick it to it. And I'm not going to crease it because I want the petals of the flower to stay open a little bit. There we go, and stick that down like that. Okay. Then what we need to do is we need to cut 16 of these off. About just under a centimetre in width. There we go, so that's one, two, and 16 there we go so these are the petals for our flower okay so what we're going to do we're going to use one of our circles and we're going to have it upside down and then we're going to start sticking these petals on do them with the stuck side that's going to be stuck onto the middle of the flower okay we want to leave the open side open so easiest way I've found to use the glue dots, instead of trying to peel those off and them getting stuck to your fingers and whatever, um, use whatever you're going to stick it to, pop that on, then it peels off quite easily. And I'm going to do these in a clock design. So 12, 3, 6 and 9. And then the next four, I'm going to put in between those. It's a lot quicker with the glue darts because you're not having to wait for print stick or glue stick to dry and everything's sliding about. There we go. So that's the first eight on. And then with the second eight, I'm going to put those in between each of the others. Try and make sure you've got even gaps between them all. Way around. 
make sure you stick in the end that's already stuck down into there. Make sure the knife isn't even as well. Okay, so we get that nice circular shape of a flower. And the last one. There we go. And that's the petals finish. Give it a good press down, make sure everything's stuck. And if we turn it over, we can see we've got our flower. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to stick this other part, the other middle of the flower, and our stem. With the stem, again using the pointy side, so that's hidden inside, I just roll it around one of the glue dots. And I put a couple on there. Can you see that? Just gluing that on there. There we go. And then that sticks nicely into there. And then pop some glue dots onto the other middle of the flower. Possibly four would do it. I'm just going to stick another one on just to make sure it's stuck down properly. And we'll stick this in the middle, just like that. Press it down really well, and there's our finished flower. There we go. Thank you for watching, and I hope you can join me again soon.